What's up guys, Carbon Fan 921 AK Masticators. I'm finally here to do my Christmas movie reviews and to start off I'm gonna start off with a really a really good movie that Yeah. And you guys notice that I am wearing a hat right now. This hat came with um well first of all let me just talk about the movies movie that I'm gonna review. I'm gonna review Home Alone then Home Alone 2. I mean, I'll, I'll review them separate, but yeah. And help me out, I have this bad boy right here. Yeah, that's right. I got, this is an exclusive, um, um, set, um, two disc, um, Blu-ray, which contains, um, a hat, which is this hat right here. Um, it's the hat that um, Macaulay Culkin um, uses um, um, wears in the first movie. All right. So yeah. So um, yeah. And Home Alone. I gotta say, Home Alone is a Christmas movie. I mean, in my opinion, you know, because it takes place on Christmas, and so does the second film. They're both Christmas movies. I mean, hell, there's a Christmas. Uh, ball there. So yeah, you got Homo. So yeah, first two are really good, but then, you know, when they came around, they got three shitty sequels that were, I think, I'm not sure if the third one went to theaters, but I know that the fourth and fifth one, uh, were straight to video. Really. And the reason why those movies sucked is because Macaulay Culkin wasn't in it. And it wasn't directed by Chris Col and they weren't directed by Chris Columbus. They were directed by other random people. You guys got random kids. After the first two really the first two are classics, but then you got other shit going on when and there's gonna be a sixth movie. Stop making straight to video Home Alone movies. First two are all that we need, just like open season. Stop making open season sequels. But yeah, this is a really cool set. I really like this a lot. I'm 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 gonna keep the box. Um so yeah. Yeah, this um this is um you can only get this at Target with the hat and now, Home Alone, um, um, here's the thing. This is a classic right here. Um, it did, it did get 54% on Rotten Tomatoes, which, that doesn't make sense, to be honest with you. To, yeah, um, because really, everybody, everybody I know likes this movie. Except for my mom. Yeah, but... At least it got 7.4 on IMDb. Just so you know, um, here are the Blu-rays. Two discs. There's digital codes, which I'm not showing. But yeah, Home Alone is a really good um, movie, um, which came out in 1990. So, which means the film's 25 years old now. You know, this is probably Macaulay Culkin's best film. Probably right next to My Girl and... Yeah. He was also in The Page Master, which was a pretty underrated film. But sadly, you know... Around then, he stopped making movies. You know, he... Oh, yeah, he was also in The Good Son, which I did not care for The Good Son. I just thought it was boring. Really. You know, I do miss uh, Macaulay Culkin uh, being in films, but you know what? But you know what? I can understand um why he left... um. But, um, Home Alone's really good, okay? 
you basically have um Kevin who is um who basically causes trouble a lot and what what happens is um the family is going to be going to it's going to be going to uh, it's going on a Christmas vacation and they're going to be flying there and everybody gets ready the next day and but here's one thing they left Kevin behind when Kevin wakes up his whole family's gone so he stays home alone and he just does random stuff um and pretty much Kevin's happy because um a little bit the first time because because he feels like that no nobody in his family likes him and that he always causes trouble like there's this one guy named Buzz who I think is his brother he really doesn't like him. Buzz doesn't like um we'll call uh Kevin and So yeah, um while his family's gone, um the mom realizes as soon as she gets on the plane, um so um she has to go back now and then what happens is um um, Kevin is a really clever kid, you know, he knows how to get away with stuff, like getting pizza, pretending that he's an adult, getting pizza, he uses a movie, which is pretty cool, and, alright, now you got these bad guys, which are robbers, and what happens is, um, they want to rob this house, but there's a, but Kevin is in it, so... Yeah, one, yeah, so in the night, oh yeah, there's also this guy which Macaulay, which Kevin thinks is scary guy, thinks that he's a bad person, but later on, um, when the guy talks to him, um, he's actually a really nice person, alright, I like that, I liked that that happened, you know, so yeah, um, Kevin, um, Kevin gets his um defense up when you know the bad guys try to rob um his house so he makes all these traps and stuff and all this other shit and this is and let me just say he's a really he's a really smart kid I mean really he knows he knows what he's doing he's setting up all these traps to take down the bad guys you know he got away with it really and that's what is really awesome about this movie Kevin got away with it okay but they're and then the bad guys think that they caught him but then you got the but then you got the neighbor which whacks them in, which whacks the bad guys in the head with a snow shovel so yeah he's not a bad guy after all so they go to jail and then they got home and then, when the mom gets there, everything goes back, everything is fine now, alright? The mom comes back, and the whole family comes back, and Kevin is perfectly safe. So yeah, that's um, pretty much the plot of the movie. Now, what do I think of it? Back then, I used to have not cared for it. But then, as i grown, i I grown into the movie a lot. It's a really good movie. I mean, really, Home Alone really is a classic holiday movie. I mean, really, the acting is really good. Um, uh, Macaulay Culkin does a really good job, and everything about it is just awesome. You know, and Kevin himself um, is a really awesome character. I mean, really. Also, you got that famous, you got those parts where, of course, um... You got the famous scream thing where where he goes, ah. so yeah, that pretty much explains why I did that in the the beginning. But yeah, um, but yeah, this is a really good movie. Okay, the acting's really good. Um, Chris Columbus did a really good job directing it. It's classic, really good film to watch on the holidays. The music, the music's really good. Um, by John Williams and the score, and if you're wondering oh, what that sound is, that's my mom vacuuming. 
So, yeah. Sorry about that. But anyways, um, Home Alone definitely gets, um, for me, um, I give it four and a half out of five. It's a really good movie. If you have not checked, if you have not seen it, I highly recommend it. It's a really good, um, uh, Christmas film. So yeah, definitely check this movie out if you haven't. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. See you guys later. Word out.